Welcome back, YouTube fam, to Art of Conquest, Beginner's Guide to Lunari. Today we're just going to be talking strictly about base Lunari, and we're going to be talking about free-to-play versus patron. And I am talking both patrons. We will also throw the, uh, what was it called? We will also throw the booster in the mix. I still consider the booster a budget item. It's probably the second best deal in the game. Lifetime Patron being by far the best deal in the game. So let me start off by asking. Who would you choose next? The reason why I ask is because if we look at our chests over here, the next one that we pick will be the hero that we get. I'm always afraid when I'm scrolling through these that I'm accidentally gonna click open one. <sighs> always so scared so I just want to say thank you so much for the support I remember when uh, my first month I remember like begging friends you know just begging friends and family to subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll always remember the number 12 the number 12 was when I was so excited when I first got to 12 subscribers I was really happy that was the first um, growth spurt I had ever seen in the YouTube channel and now the fam is growing at often over 12 subscribers a day just know that support it really inspires me even though I'm gonna be working quite a bit I'm gonna do my best to put out two videos a day and if I ever get into a rhythm you know I want to start putting out three videos on three games a day and it is your support that makes that possible so thank you so much and a quick shout out to OGC gaming it was his breakdown videos that is really opening my mind to making down to making some new breakdown videos so if you're not a, a subscriber to his channel yet he is putting out the best information on this game and I'll admit better than mine so first off what we have here is our sign-in bonus and our sign-in bonus is 300 Lenari a week which if you we're gonna do annual numbers <laughs> so I will try to put these numbers on the screen it is a uh, it is a new it is something new on my editing that I've not done before so if I mess that up or even if I don't mess that up I will put these numbers down in the description down below as well so first we have the login bonus which comes out to 15,600 a year and you get that just by logging in there's really nothing else you have to do and then second up for just being on the server for logging in after the Imperium event you're gonna get one of these which gives you another 100 Lenari but you don't want just that at the very least attack and for attacking any base at the Imperium or having any battle in the Imperium I mean you can just go out there and just you know you can troll someone with one hero if you want to and you're going to get all these rewards, including 300 Lunari. So I'm going to assume that, you know, you're going to be available to attack once in the Imperium event. And on free-to-play, that's another 400 Lunari every two weeks. Or another 10,400 Lunari a year. Which is, you know, pretty good. Now, these two pieces of information are going to be very speculative. And I'm going to base it off of this server. So, so far on this server, let's see if I have an example anywhere on here. So here we go. Here's an issue. Issue that the character does not respond when collecting a stone slab or recruit troops in the wild. Been fixed. <laughs> oh, has been fixed. I was actually going to say a typo. There wasn't a typo there. You can simply restart the game and continue your journey. Thanks as always for the support. Over the word Bane, who's always handing out fat stacks to Lenari. So I would say with these issues on this server, which have been extremely minimum, we can add about another 600 a month. Which you would add another 7,200 a year annually. And finally, now the codes. I can only base it off of last month. Last month, Lenari codes. And it wasn't even last month, it was, uh, it was weekly. 
So for the last four weeks, the Lenari codes have added up to 770 Lenari. And if you multiply that by 13, you're gonna get 10,110 more Lenari on free to play. And the reason why, <laughs> I gotta digress a little bit. The reason why I say this is huge speculation is because I logged into an old, old account that was nine months old, that was a, a cross server account where I think a lot of things must have gone down incorrectly because on that account, I got 22,000. I think it was, it was above 22,000. I don't remember if it was 300 or 800, but it was, <laughs> it was that type of writing. It was either a three or an eight. So for nine months, I mean, that is crazy, but maybe there were a lot of issues at that time. Maybe there's a lot more that goes into a server merger that causes a lot of issues as well. We well, never know, maybe they were just being generous. <laughs> that is also a possibility. So when we get to all that free-to-play Lenari, and we're not even going to get into the royalty. I mean, the royalty, if you get in good with the people of your faction, there's a good chance they're going to give you a sub spot, which is 100 Lenari a week. But we're not even going to get into that. So just with going into the game, attacking the Imperium, putting in your Lenari codes, and, you know, having some issues on your servers, you're going to get 43,000. 310 Lenari, which breaks down to 3,609 Lenari a month. Pretty good. Pretty good for just playing the game. I mean, that's a heck of a lot more than it used to be. I remember Lenari used to be impossible to come by, except Patreon and buying it outright. So they have really increased the amount of free-to-play Lenari. Now these, uh, when I, when I finally looked at all these, I was a little bit blown away by how much Lenari you can get just from Patron and Lifetime Patron. And, uh, of course, uh, you know, the booster. The booster is um, another 16,868, but I've heard it's not in all regions. So we'll put that number in at the last moment. So for your Patron, you're getting 100 Lenari a day, which adds another 36,500 annually. And then your lifetime patron, which is infinite. Let's say you want to get rid of your regular patron. I mean, your lifetime patron is still going to give 18,250 Lenari every year, forever. You know, just if you want to log into the game. And then, of course, if you have your booster. So just with your patron and lifetime patron and all of the things you get free to play, we're talking 98,060 Lenari. No competition, just playing the game on a daily basis. $5 a month, $15 for the year. So we're talking, you know, $75 for the first year and then $60 for every year after that. Um, not the worst price in a mobile game for a ridiculous amount of Lenari. And then if you get the, uh, if you get the booster, only for one year, but you're going to get 114,928 Lenari for the year. See how the dragon's doing. So, that's a, that's a good amount of Lenari. I'm going to go over, not in the next video, in the next video we're going to go over competition. All the Lenari you can jet, get just for every current competition. This is actually kind of a useless skill to me. And this is going to be a year in the making. One day, it's going to take a very long time. One day we will have enough Valor cards that we have gotten our daily Valor cards for a year. And we will get to see what those Valor cards combined with our Dragon Valor cards are. So we will know exactly how much, like how many of these VIP levels we would have for playing free to play for a year. Uh, obviously this is not a free to play account. I spent as much as I could, as quickly as I could, to get to tier 9. But the moment I got to tier 9, I decided to start saving those Valor cards. So one day we will know that piece of information. I thank you all for watching. Once again, thank you all so much for the support. 
it is uh, it is very exciting for me I'm gonna try to put out the best information I can make sure to check out that OGC y'all have a great day